All right, section seven, control equipment. The TM551263 Department of the Army Technical Manual Locomotive Diesel Electric 56 and a half inch gauge 65 sun 0440 400 horsepower General Electric Cummins engine model HBIS 600 United Department of the Army March 1955. Section 7, Control Equipment, the N, um, the 95, the 17K, 27A1 controller. The controller consists of a small drum with the three phosphorus bras fingers mounted in the back with the removable of the cup to operate with the means of removable the lever to serve the control of the position of reverse hands the direction of the locomotive movement the fingers should be tested periodically to see that they have sufficient pressure of the thumb contacts to ensure the good contact of the thumb film green, uh, grease should be implied with the cylinder with lubrication inspection period to prevent cutting of the fingers and segment carefully um, should be taken to note that you use too much lubrication as it will to collect down under the fingers and cause poor contact. The fingers should be renewed and when worn down about halfway to the contact point after such a time the fingers do not provide a satisfactory start wheel star wheel action. The controller mechanic mechanically interlocked with the throttle mechanism preventing moving of the controlling handle all times except when the throttle handle is in the off position idling or in the idle position. It should however be possible to move the throttle handle at all times regardless of the control handle position. Interlocking should be connected uh, checked as inspection period to see if it's working properly. N um, 96 ME 78 C2 reverser. The reverser is operated with a double cylinder air engine um, controlled with the two with one on the type of magnetic valve. The reverser is interlocked with the, they cannot be thrown with the except with the motor contractor open the verse does not carry any of the current no roughness should be caused by burning and any roughness be developed due to the other causes should be removed by the file the frequent inspection should be made with the guard and again for the weak fingers poor contact loose connections the contact should be cleared um, with the necessary lubricated with a thin film or grease the reverser should be tested to operation with the pressure of the valve at the top of the magnet valve with the operating of the slow segment bearing as well as lubricated cylinders probably dry and will require oiling sluggish action of the reverser may also be caused by the sticking or leaking magnet valves. All right, all maintaining contact, adjusting the step of the periodically inspected with ensure the proper contact is always obtained between the fingers and segments while in contact. All right, this shows the uh, the armature winding installation of the GHM motor. This shows the speed tractive effort scale. This shows the motor characteristic curve scale. Tire pressure also can be variable. The slightly adjusting of the screw should be not used, um, used for this purpose, but only with the adjustment compensation for the finger wear when they properly adjust with the tip of the pressure, which should become within the limited to specified with the paragraph 97 of the week of the broken finger should be replaced, but the following procedure will be followed. Place a strip of the thin paper between the individual fingers and segments and turn the back of the adjusting screw until the paper can be easily pulled out. Turn down the adjusting screw until the space between fingers locking pane and 2730 seconds an inch. All control fingers should be periodically inspected to ensure the making of the proper the contact adjusting the proper amount with leaving the segment this will produce the pressure proper, proper pressure unless the spring is at the fault with which the case is to be renewed for the care of the adjusting of the magnet valve the use of the reverser with the instruction given the paragraph 98 all right data me 78 c2 reverser capacity 400 amperes continual to main contact data the finger pressure of the segment of 15 to 20 pounds for the each of the individual vigor wearing allowance one at the g one g for a g one g of an inch of the control finger to that of the finger pressure within the segment two to five pounds wearing allowance Halfway through permissible drop with, with leaving segment three thirty two of an inch to one eighth of an inch magnet valve de coil data G E number two zero four five one five eight resistance twenty five Celsius one hundred forty five ohms ninety eight the magnet valve um, the following instruction cover the care of the maintenance of the magnet valves which are used to actuate the uh, Reverse of the bursters are all open on the open top of the cross sectional view of the open and close with the whole valve that's shown in figure 21, 22. The valve is the double action type that has the that exhaust port as well as the port of the connecting the operation cylinder. This value constructed with the coil of the energy of the exhaust port of the closed with the inlet port of the open and admitting with the air of the reserve of the operating cylinder. The coil of the energy energy of the inlet port of the closed with the exhaust port open with the content of the cylinder to atmosphere. When the valves are sticky, sticky, they should be washed with the kerosene or petroleum cleaner as pour a little kerosene or the petroleum cleaner through the magnet cord to clean the valve seat. When the valves are removed, the care should be taken to the intro of the each of the valves is returned to the own seat on each of the stem the ground and fits its own seat. 
When the new valve is installed, when they're preparing the leakage, what may must be in ground with a good seat, but they obviously obtained with all the grinding materials should be blown out with the air with the valve to wash with the kerosene or other petroleum cleaner with a larger number of the valves to be ground with the cost of the reduce the usual special reamers in the valve the valve seats before the valves are grounded in. After the air gap is tra and trapped the rub magnet valves should be periodically measured with the gap gauge of the GE 1499733. Figure 25 and 26 is arranged with the four measuring gaps should be the used in the check of this still applies. The adjustment of the new valve the measurements are made with the removing the magnet valve with the core of the amateur at 0, 0.32 thousandths of an inch of the gap. The gauge, gap, gauge is placed with the, over the upper st stem of the plunger. Pressed um, down in the steam of the exhaust valve that is the air should not escape with the exhaust valve. If the air passes through the new valves and should be installed, the G valve valve. G. The valve travel is stamped on the bottom of the surface of the cap of the plug, plug on the magnet valve. The H. When installing the new valve, the following measurement should be taken on using the gap gauge. GE 1499733. Placing the five, placing the 52 thousandths of an inch gap over the exhaust valve of the step. And the pass down with the valve stem is if the correct get, um, length of the exhaust valve will see if the air will not pass over the, through it and leg of the gauge of the rest on the magnet of the core. But the condition of the not satisfied with the valve should be lengthened and shortened with the exhaust valve stem is found to be short. It can be lengthened and a trifle and be careful to be fully painted over the upper hand upper end after Operating pin, cover, armature, magnet coil, magnet core, exhaust valve, stem, magnet valve, exhaust valve, inlet valve, exhaust port valve, seat, bushing, cylinder, ver from reserve and from inlet valve of the car, prepared, plug the enclosed coil on the open non type magnet valve. Figure 22 is an op open coil O on on, one, um, on type magnet valve. You cover the opening operating with the armature, the exhaust valve seam, the magnet coil, the, mag um, the magnet core, the exhaust port, the exhaust valve valve seat, the to the cylinder inlet valve with the inlet valve spring the in from the reservoir and cap plug. Figure 23 is a micro dial gauge for the adjusting magnet valve. Figure 24 with the measuring of the micro metal dial ga uh, gauge. Um, Exhaust valve shell has been set, been on the ground with the number of the times um, found with the exhaust valve stem with the standard length of the short to be adjusted with the call with the bulb that can then be attained with the, this case overall length of the valve. Should be used the valve stem and are uh, supplied with one sixteenth of an inch length longer with the one furnished with the new valves. Figure 25 is an enclosed coil on the on type of the magnetic valve gauge for the proper of the checking valve stem uh, travel. And then figure 26, the open coil on the top of the magnet valve is gauged with the proper placement of the checking valve to see the stem um, travel. Two, um, using an 88,000 of an inch gap of the valve, the 36,000 of an inch travel, the 104,000 of an inch gap of the valve, the 52,000 of an inch travel, the proper gap of the exhaust valve, stem of the gauge less, resisting the magnetic core of the top of the inlet valve, the stem of the proper length of the upper exhaust valve, the stem from the flush of the gap surface, the air will not pass through the inlet valve, the air pressure for the inlet valve removes the small amount of the inlet valve stem of the space between the top of the exhaust upper valve, the stem gauge gap installs in the inlet valve, the Longer, loner st um, stem. Uh, I'm sorry about this. It's just a stupid Kapowski thing. Capra Sky. To check the worn valve, to place the 32,000 inch gap over the exhaust valve with the press the pros down. The exhaust valve does not um, scat. These are the air passing through the valve and install the new valve to take the measurement that's described above. In order to do this, quickly remove the magnet valve with the apparatus, then um, can be done with the quickly, um, quite re readily taking out the two cap bolts near the bottom of the top valve. More accurate method of measuring the valves um, is by using the standard micrometer with the gauge with the special figure 23 of the method using the gauge is illustrated in figure 24 with especially convenient where there are large numbers the valves are overheated with it as well as the amount of the material to be removed from the new valves can be determined right directly from rather than by cutting or the trying the process the proper valve stem the pressure but measured above the magnetic valve of the core is given above the, um, in the paragraph 99 magnetic valve a the oe type number 2051 Five seven travel to thirty six thousand inch G number two zero five one five eight resistance at twenty five degrees Celsius one hundred forty five arms current operating pressure zero to ninety three thousand for the amp at one hundred pounds continuous current thirty two um, hundreds of thirty thirty four hundred for the amp and apparatus used the ME seventy eight C two reverser four side of the measuring the gauge G fourteen ninety nine seven three three 
Wrench for the magnetic core G260513. The magnetic core ga um, gauge the G281273. The gauge of the caps to be used 36,000 of an inch. Travel the new valve with the valve. De energized with 88,000 of an inch. Valve with energized with the 52,000 of an inch. Worn valve the wear limited for 32,000 inches above the valve. The rail should be measured having the legs of the gauge for the the to the top of the magnet core. All right, it's, um, one hundred two. Uh, type of the seventeen C contact. The contact is lightweight, single pole magnetic op operative with the bend of the frame with the construction of the tray armature of the rocker band with the contactor must be mounted to the supporting base of the vertical plane with the, the contact at the tip the up of the nesser with the contact to provide with the blowout with the coils of the air chute to assist the rupturing of the air with the true air chute is easily moved making the contact tips readily accessible. The contactor should be manually operated during the inspection and to detect the manual mechanical defects of the care which should be taken from the all circumstances be energized before the manually closing during doing any of the con work on the contactor the cop and contacts should be kept and clean. If they become burned or pitted, they should be dressed up lightly with the application of fine file with extreme care should be taken to ensure that the fill line of the contact and cross the heap in between the two types of the surfaces are filling. The tips are too badly pitted, but they should be renewed. The contact tips should also be renewed when they are worn halfway through. The contacts of 17CM15HH6 uh, contactors are sil uh, silver faced, but this should require little attention if it becomes... Necessary to clean the contacts, use the cleaning a clean lintless, lintless um, cloth wet with wet carbon tetrahydrochloride with uh, fine file. Do not use sandpaper the memory cloth as they will leave harmful gain for the contact surface. If the files used with the care must be taken to not remove the, much of the material, the, the IC 17CM 12 J 15 contactors non well the alloy contact tip of the copper the color and distinguished for the copper tip of the having the S identified with the side maintenance should be the same the copper tips. The contact of the pressure should be checked with the periodically to do this inside and so insert the thin, thin piece of the paper with the contacts. F um, fully close the armature within mechanically by engineering the operating coils attached to single spring of the balance with the wire and string and the up the nester of the head of the spring holding up the move the contact tip of the balance should be then pulled to the perpendicular line of the contact until the paper, paper can be easily moved. The whole of the instant of the paper can be moved in contact with the tip of the pressure preferred to the figure 27 to 8. The type of the gap, gap of the wire with the contact tip should be periodically with the type but the tip of the gap of the distance between when the contactor is fully open, the whip of the, the wipe the switch for the move of the line of the final fill, final tip of the contact mentioned with the arm of the move it after the tip touches the distance for the movable the tip would be movable in position as it was just the fixed up of the position. It would also be where the fixed tip of the place when the armature fully closed and against the stop. The contactor is provided with the adjustment armature with the obtain the positive opening with the operator in core with the de-energized the spring properly adjusted with the factory, but does not require any of the further adjustments. And even the contactor disassembled the adjuster with the if the other were disturbed, the operating coil should be connected to the variable voltage service of the pick it up the current check against the specified figure forty eight. J, the contact tip should be renewed with the worn halfway through this, um, when the silver facing weren't worn through the braided copper shunt of this shirt, which carries the current for the moving the contact of the contactor terminal should be inspected periodically renewed before the base becomes badly worn or broken. Um, figure 27 shows the measuring of the final contact tip of the pressure armature fully closed on, as shown in with the, um, twin paper wire, wipe, wet. Thin, um, thin paper wider than the tips. The um, wire strap must be cl clearly a, a arc shoot the support spring. Fully perpendicular with the line contact detailed paper and can be easily moved. The armature fully closed as shown. Your data 17 cm contact with the contactor symbol of the locomotive of the wire gram of the amper is continuous capacity tip of the gra um, gap of the brake of the whip of the w wipe of the wear and allowance the initial pressure final pressure catalog, uh, catalog number of the out and resistance at 25 degrees Fahrenheit. Approximate pickup of the ampers and catalog number to blow out coil. 102 interlocks. The engine starting with the contact are provided with the electrical interlock with the interlock continues consists essentially with the contact bar attached with the contact armature with the insulation contact features with which are attached with the contact frame through the insulation contact pressure to contact with the wipe at the tip of the grab with the brake, but this should be periodically inspected. Um this uh seldomly necessary to check the excess pressure except when the contact is suspected of the beginning of the fault with the wipe of the pressure to begin breaking the given below the in blue and in the sea the sea below but the, both the stationary or the moving contact with the silver face, but this should require the very little attention and becomes necessary to claim the contact 
effect of the use of the clean, relentless cause with the wet and the carbon tetrachloride. But the use of the plant file do not use sandpaper, the emery cloth. The, you, these will leave harmful gains for the grains in the contact surface. If the, the file may be used, the care should be taken not to remove too much of the material. Contact parts should be placed when the silver facing has worn through. The interlock data. Contactors should be used in type of the 17AF14H1 and type of the 17CM12J15. Sim, um, symbol is GS1 and GS21. Wipe the 32 inch, 532 inch chip of the gap of the rake at 62, 632 inch, and 932 inch pressure of 8 ounces. 103 type DB 1663A relay. The relay is a magnet valve that has a hinge with the spring based armature for the armature carry for the insulation block with the wood, which for the contact figures is assembled the fingered which for the spring mount with the silver contact face for the making of the contact with the silver, fa single fa silver face stationary contact stub. The DB 1663A 17A7 relay was used with the motor field with the um, shunning the contra contra control relay operators as a function with the generated via, um, relay voltage. The back because the voltage can be adjusted over the limited the range to change the de energizing position of the armature. The hint of the air gap, the adjusting of the domain with the being of the adjustable armature stopped, increase the opening air depth, increase the bolt, pick up the voltage, the dropout voltage can be adjusted with the changing of the tension spring, which is attached with the armature to decrease the tension lower over the drop of the bolt. There's increase the raise to be dropped out of the voltage, and the pickup of the setting should always be rechecked after the any changes that made with the dropout setting is made will also be effective. The E, the contacts being the silver face, should be seldom re require attention and it becomes necessary to clean the contacts that use the cleanliness, the lightness of the cloth wet with the carbon tetrachloride. Using a fine file, but do not use sandpaper. Aim with the cloth that will leave the harmful grains for the contact surface and fail. You carefully must be taken to note not remove the much of the material. The contact should be replaced when the silver facing has worn through. The contact tip pressure gauge with a gap. The wipe it should be periodically checked against the well used given below. The wipe contacts making the relay con and pickup can be adjusted by screwing the stationary contact stud into the uh, and out of um, into or out of when proper operation adjustment tip of the gap should be always be equal or greater than the minimum of the you specify the tip gap, one eighth of an inch minimum, wipe the three thirty two of an inch minimum, um and pressure the eight ounce eight ounces minimum. 104, uh, type 17HE9E1 control sw switches. Um, description of the cam operator of the switch having the three nominal opening contacts, terminal, two normally closed for the contacts with the switch in idle position operated with the cams mounted with the three operating shaft. So that the position of the switch corresponding with the position of the, uh, Throttle handle in the manner that was switched to be used as a controller to control the operation of the traction motor, the general teaser field, the circuit, the inspection maintenance. All terminals contacts should be inspected with making sure that they are eight, they are tight. The camshaft should be turned thoroughly in its operating range to make sure that it turns freely, that the good contact is made between the movable fingers and the stationary contacts. Both stationary and movable contacts have silver contacts. So surfaces should require little attention and becomes necessary to clean the contacts. Use the clean, clean lintless cloth with a wet with a carbon tetrachloride. Use the fine file. Do not use sand paper the emery cloth as they will leave harmful grains in the contact surface of the file the use of care must be taken not to remove too much of the material the contact should be replaced when the silver facing has been worn through the contact wipe the type gauge the tip gap should be checked periodically against the valve the given below the 17 HE91 data the tip of the gap is 1132 to the 332 of an inch drop or 332 the drop is 332 of an inch to 1 eighth of an inch and the pressure 3 quarters to 1 pound all right, 105. The resistors, various type of the resistors are used. The different circuits for the um, connection refer to the figure 28, 29, and 48. The type 17E W resistor furnished for the traction motor field shunning circuit. The resistor should be inspected periodically and ensure the tie rods and holding the end to units placed in our type with all the connections. The tie insulation pulls between the units the must should be kept clean at all times. The following out the dry compressor air being the careful with the pressure is not too high. The adjusting the type of the resistor of the furnished with the uh, furnished with the type of the 17 FR panels with the resistor panels with the provided with the R4 with the generator field circuit. The resistor should be inspected periodically to ensure the tie rods are tight with the yield of the collapse and terminal all the tight. The resistor windings should be also be inspected to see that they are not broken and nickel or may have any short circuit as it returns. Replace porcelain tubes if they are cracked or broken. D. Virtuous enabled enameled resistor tubes are also provided with the field for generator field to light and heater circuits are they also beginning with the mounted on the type of the 17 FR panel. These resistors should be examined periodically to ensure the terminals are tight and the tubes have not been broken or damaged. Um, Figure 28 shows the connecting diagram for the EW resistor. The figure 29 shows the contracting connection diagram for the 17 FR11A13 resistor panel. 
the six one hundred six um type of the DO uh, DO forty seven instrument. The instrument operative with the DA or uh, Everson principle using the permanent magnet of the field of the coil on the moving element of the, for the armature of the instrument should be periodically inspected to ensure the terminals are tight with the pointers or if down zero with the pointers do not stick. The pointer may be on the um, set on zero for the turning of the small screw with the located with the front of the cover. The screw means means if a small cam change with the position of the metal piece with which the coil spring is attached, thus changing the tension of the spring moving the zero with the position of the pointer accordingly. Pointer may be tested with the sticking by electrically obtained maximum deflection and noting the result of the circuit is broken. If the pointer does not readily return to zero, the instrument should be removed from cleaning and for cleaning and calibration. E. No attempt should be made to adjust and remove the instrument from the circuit unless with the certainty of the o or, um, current is off that all the terminals and elements of the instrument are alive. When external shunts are used, the ammeter with the ammeter, the ammeter must be calibrated with the shunt the same with the current and the minimal mini, mi, milli voltage rating as the shunt with with which it was to be used. The shunt leads must be also be approximately the same resistance as the leads with which the ammeter is to be used. Install shunt so that the metal, metal metallic dirt dust can be um, cannot be without resistance. Strip of the short circuit with the shunt to keep the terminal screw with the tight of all the times. Do not allow the leads to become wet and thus short circuited with the artificial ventilation and not require for the temperature to rise between. Maybe between 40 degrees to 50 degrees Fahrenheit, 7 Celsius, or 72 to 90 degrees Fahrenheit above the ambient, and there should be to be enough ventilation to take care of this rise. H, when the voltmeters are provided with external resistance, we can or must be taken with the voltmeters calibrated with the use of the external resistors. Section 8, type 202G and 2023G generators.